Let's say you forgot your Samsung Galaxy screen password. You don't have access to your phone. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you three different ways how to remove or unlock your Samsung Galaxy without losing any data. Let's go. All right, guys, for the first method, you need a computer, a phone, or any device that you can use to sign in to your Samsung Galaxy account. Let's start off opening the browser. So it can be any browser, Safari, Chrome, any browser you want, guys. Open it up and you're gonna search for this website. So it's gonna be find my mobile Samsung, okay? Just type in that and then hit the enter. On this page, let's go ahead and click on the first link, find my Samsung, the first one, just go right there. On the next page, you're gonna use your email and your password to sign in into your Samsung Galaxy account. As soon as you are into your account, you will see right here the map, and also on the right side, you will see this square with different actions. From here, you can track your phone if you lose it, or you can unlock your Samsung Galaxy device in case you forget the password. So just click right there, unlock. And as you can see, it says right here, unlock your phone remotely when you forget the unlock method. So basically, that's what we want. So let's go ahead and click on unlock. Then you will see this page. You will have to type in your password just to confirm that it's you. You know what I mean? So just to make sure. Just wait a few seconds. So as you can see, the process started. Just wait and you will see, guys. It will be unlocked as you can see my phone is unlocked something that i really like about this method is that this method allows you to unlock your phone to remove any password without losing data you know what i mean so you just remove the screen password you still have all your apps data photos contact everything right there now let's say you couldn't sign in into your samsung galaxy account or you didn't have a samsung galaxy account before so let me show you now another method to unlock your phone all we're gonna do is factory reset these phones you will have to sign in with your google account so you need to know your google account and your password and everything that is on your google account and your password or your personal data that was backed up in your google account you will get it back so just turn off your phone Press the power button and turn off your phone. If your phone asks for the password, so what you're gonna do, you're gonna press and hold down for like 10 seconds, the power button and the volume up until your phone turn off. Once your phone is completely off, what you're gonna do, you're gonna press and hold down the power button and volume up at the same time until you see a menu pop up on your phone screen. Let's do it. Volume up and power button. And as you can see, that's the menu that you have to see on your phone screen to unlock your phone. So once you see that, you're going to use now the volume down to scroll down on that menu. Okay, let's do it. Just scroll down until you see the factory reset action. Then just hit the power button one time. Right here to confirm what you're going to do, you're going to press the volume down to go to the last setting to factory reset your phone. And that's all you need to do. So I'm not going to do that on my phone because I already like my phone, as you know. Just press the power button one time and the process is going to start. When the process is done, so your phone will turn off and will turn it back on automatically. Then it's time to set up your phone. Remember, you will have to sign in with your Google account. So you need to know your Google account and your password and everything that is on your Google account, your password or your personal data that was backed up in your Google account, you will get it back. Now, let me show you the last method. So let's say you download an app on your phone. Sometimes we download launchers on the phone and it lack the screen. You know what I mean? So sometimes we don't even know that that app is going to lack the screen. On this video, let me show you how to remove the password without losing data. It's really easy, guys. What you're going to do, you're going to press the power button on your phone until you see the turn off action. So now you're going to press the turn off action for a few seconds until you see safe mode. OK, let's do it. Once you see that, just press the safe mode. Your phone is going to turn off and it's going to turn it back on on safe mode. On safe mode, the phone will allow you to remove the app that is lacking your phone screen. It's really easy, guys. So right here, as you can see, we have some great apps. Great apps means that are not allowed to be running on your phone right now because your phone is on safe mode, as you can see on the bottom. So let's go ahead and open the settings on your phone to remove the app. Scroll down until you see apps. Let's go ahead and click on apps. Let's go ahead and search for the app that is lacking your phone screen. So if you know the name, you will see it right here. For example, this one right here, what you're going to do, you're going to uninstall the app. Just click on the action and that will remove the app and just restart your phone. Just turn off your phone, press the power button, turn off your phone and your phone will be good to go. And that's all you need to do, guys. If you got any question, please let me know in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button. See you in my next video.